This is some Croatia shape in the first half of the game. Oh, bodies dropping in deep, you've got to say. I've got to say this, but I think Albania using the 4 3 3 in the first half definitely put a lot of pressure on Croatia, making their lives so difficult. And just so you know, of course, um, uh, what was it? I think um, one of the Albanian players forced Lovakovic to hit the ball long early on, and um, I think um, Albania did a pretty good job of tight passing the ball very tidily when they received the pat ball. Look at that! Look at this! Pressure in the first half, pressure in the first half from the black Albanian shirts. And all the Croatian defenders were having to backpedal quite severely. And, um, of course, I think um, Albania's goal came from what was quite a tidy counter-attack early on. Look at this. So quite a few Albanian players. Okay, they're not super high up on the pitch, but you can see the positioning is really good. Like ready to sprint in behind Croatia's back line if needs be. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That guy there is now sprinting in with the Croatian play. No Croatian players mark again, but that is. Well, this is actually some pretty poor defending by the Croat back line. And of course, as you can see there, look. The Croatian player with no one marking him. A huge gap opened up in between the Croat back line. And Laxi was able to score an easy header, uncontested. Great job by Albania pressing Croatia relentlessly, relentlessly in the first half. I mean, would you look at that? Just static defending by the Croats, and surprisingly, they didn't. They only had four defenders back for this goal, so it wasn't very good. Of course, though, I have to say, um, um, Al, what's it? Slatko Dalic. Deciding to not slack on Dalic, Silvino decided to switch to a back five was a mistake though because it did allow Croatia to pile bodies forward when needs be. And um, I think, um, to be fair to Albania, I think their second goal pretty much came because the Croatians opened up a lot of space behind their back line. And, um, oh, I need to see the second Albanian goal because I think, um, could the Croats, for some baffling reason, decided to back off and defend when they went 2 1 up. But really, I mean, for some baffling reason, the Croatian midfielders, as you saw from those top images, didn't pick anyone up, they didn't track runners for some back for some odd reason. It just wasn't good enough um, on Croatia.